time to lone wolf it. Welcome to this episode, and we're just going to go out and do some lone wolf sniping. Um, most of my core group are already in co in uh, squads already, so I'm just going to go for a match by myself. And we'll go and we're just going to pick a domination. It should be fun and interesting. Hope everybody had a good day. Uh, today is, uh, what is it? Wednesday, the 19th. And today... It was 45 degrees. I went outside, rode my bike for a few minutes, had a good time, and we'll probably end up getting more snow probably in about five or six more days, but I'll take the 45 degrees that we've had. Right now it's searching for a map, and I'll, um, it takes a minute usually to find you something to get in there and fight with. Um, right now I'm just using a cheap Logi suit. Um, I don't have a whole lot of ISK, so I'm going to save as much as I can, so I'm just using a a cheap suit, uh, my good sniper rifle and a submachine gun and a nano hive. So that is the th you know, the three things that I'm utilizing. Uh, since I'm sniping, I don't need a whole lot. MCC. Wow. You guys see that lag? Holy cow. And I suicided as soon as I started. Great. Let's try it again. That lag was not good. Right now CCP is doing a lot of updating because there's a big update coming soon. I mentioned that in the previous video. And so they're trying to fix stuff before it actually goes out. Because technically it should have already been out by now. And they decided to go. I did not take any chances. I'm in suicide. Did you? This map here I call a rafter. There's a new rafter. Targeting structure coming out the side there and a lot of it would love to get up on and shoot down. I call it ducks in the row when they start doing that. I think it was actually in the previous video that I did. When I was sniping in that. Now this one is live. I am playing it. You know, these matches run, usually run around 15 minutes. So it's perfect. Um, I know some people only like 6 minute long videos. And Ooh, headshot would have actually killed him. So I can tell he's not that. He's either a scout or something. They're moving quite fast. So let's get ourselves in position. Dust is not a fast game. It should be his game. Once you get start getting in there and start killing and stuff, that's a different story. Um, ooh, I'm in the red line. See that red line right there? You go into it. Please pay attention to that. See, you got 18 seconds to get out or you will die. It's called the red line. So when you hear your squad say they're on their red line, that means over there under their ship on their red line. Alright. So what we're going to do is, one of my favorite spots is kind of right up in here because I can see uh, rafters and I can also see down into Alpha. Now this is a domination, so see there's only one objective. Um, you don't have four or five sprawled out, so it's kind of more of a concentrated battle when it comes down to it. Pretty much decent position. Now you see that one there. There's a tank right there, um, an LAV, which is a light armored vehicle. Your jeeps, basically, whatever you want to call them. Those suckers are. Uh, there's one flying around there somewhere. Where'd he go? There he is. That is the square that is empty inside. The sniping's a good thing for you know newer players to get into because um, it's cheap. You don't waste a lot of skills. And you can do a lot of damage with the militia sniper rifle. I mean, I've been killed many of times with the militia sniper rifle. Uh, whoever can kill a heavy will get if, and if a heavy kills somebody else that's not a heavy, he gets SP. So there's like a CCP put on a contest for a week or so. I don't know how truly long it is. But our core, at third, you know, Third Rock, we uh, got some good guys, good quality players. Top 50, two or three of our players are top 50 easy. One is in the top 20, um, you know, Saxon and Titan and Gilgamesh, you know, Cheech. There's a lot of good players. Um, we are a mixed batch of players too. The UK, we've got a boy from Ireland. United States, um, all over the place. And so we're, we've got a good group of guys. We have probably about 109 to 110 members in our core, 
damage a pretty decent amount, so no matter what, when you get on, you're packed. probably going to fire Fire's some more. In progress. And he's on the other side. Some games go slow, some games go fast, um, as far as not as time, but your kills. There's games when I've only may have gotten one or two, but the information and things like that that I sent through to my squad is worth more to me than kills sometimes. Best thing about sniping. See, I am, uh, for one, the reason why you won't see me go inside a lot with this character is because he is not set up to battle inside. This character is made for sniping. Really. Um, I can't take a lot of hits. I can take maybe one good uh, body shot from a sniper rifle, but if he hits me in my head, I'm down. Um, just give him. But I am not, a, uh, I'm not set up to be inside. And so that's why you won't see me inside a lot. Now, a lot of times, too, when I'm sniping, I like to scan and keep my eye on things. There's a, a lot of times guys like to hide and leave it to a, another sniper to make the game more interesting because you'll spend time hunting him down. See, that's a heavy there. You can tell by how slow he's walking. Did he go inside? Yeah. You know, I care about this game. Um, I care about Eve. They're both tied together, and I will do a video explaining it a little bit, but they're both connected, and they're going to be even more connected as time goes by. This is just beginning. There's no other company that is, is doing what CCP is doing when connecting a PC game with, uh, with this uh, console game. Nobody's done it. And so they are very, very close. It's like, um, Dust is kind of like Eve's little brother. Kind of like the baby of the family. And Eve and Dust are both incredible. See the lag right there? That guy's in the middle. See, I want to shoot him, but I don't want to waste my shots. Um, right now, our, our team, the blue team, which is what you're in, or I am, they're doing pretty good. They're winning the match so far. I just see the guy off by himself. And so they're pretty, pretty, pretty tight. Did I get him a second time? Eventually, after I snipe so many people, they'll eventually send somebody out to look for me. Always is and always will happen. If you're a person that really likes to go inside, um, I am not too bad as far as knowledge of it, even though my character doesn't do it. There we go. I need somebody to come upstairs. Um, Objective A. Hacked. Virus upload in progress. It's all you're a guy that likes to grind it out. You know. You know, if you if you want to if you want to go in there and bang Fire it out, reserves. you know, At heavy is 50%. awesome. But you gotta remember that each suit has got its goods and its bads, and heavies are very slow, but they're full and on. Um, it takes me sometimes with a heavy three to five shots to kill them. And you know, and a sniper round is more powerful than, than even a, an assault rifle round. So you can just you know, walk. Now they're starting to spawn. Sometimes I try to. You can't shoot them. It's just trying to find them. You get 15 kills from destroying them. See, they're spawning out of
funnest ones to shoot is the uh, scouts. The guys are just fast and they just run quick, so you got to really learn how to lead your target. I let him lead, he walked into my shot. One shot, one kill. I can't hear if it's a headshot, if you hear a, a gong, that means I got a headshot, so I can't even hear it the way I'm recording, so. See, this suit's very, uh, since it's a cheap suit, I can only carry one nano hive with me, and that's what's refilling my ammo for me. And so, normally I carry two or three of really good ones, um, but unfortunately, you can only carry one. But if you use. Now, let's go and check and make sure they ain't sending somebody out to look for me. Eventually, somebody's going to come running up on me. I mean, they're going to be looking for pissed. Like I said, see, I'm, I'm shooting. Um, I'm using an NT-511 sniper rifle. It is not the Ishcone or the Kaliakota, which are the um, prototype rifles. I'm using an NT-511, which is not a militia rifle, but it's still a, a decent rifle. I'm using a cheap shoot, where I'm not spending a lot of money on it. And I'm still, I've got at least five kills. Hostile okay. NCC damage so not critical. Bad. So you can play, but like I said, if I go inside, I'm a dead man. Uh, I can't take hits for anything. And if I go in and I die a lot, that means to me I hurt my team more than I did help. Even though I might get, say, three or four kills, that's better than dying ten times. Um, do you get, you know, do you understand what I'm saying? It's... I would rather be their eyes and get four or five kills and be consistent than to go in there and die every time the map isn't a sniper friendly map or what have you. Alright, my nano hive is empty so I've got 11 shots left and this match is pretty much over. So, just out having some fun.